c'è collisione, sarà per te ti amo, è un'emozione, c'è sale piano piano. Good evening. Good evening and welcome. This is the free tries that we get from Kanami and obviously you see 2000 coins. We are claiming all of this. Very nice. And uh, we are going straight into the pack opening. Actually, I'm going to be covering the uh, players that are offered by Kanami. Kanami is going nuts. Absolutely. Nobody expected them to drop these packs right when, uh, like three days after this, Oliver Kahn, National Team Guardians, Nesta and Roberto Carlos players. And there's obviously another epic Japan pack. I mean, I don't know what they're cooking. If they're dropping epic packs like that every three days, I mean, eventually they'll end up uh, like the, the legends will. They're, they're limited. You can't really like release them forever, right? Free try. I'll be doing the training guide of these guys in a second. Can I get one on my first try? Obviously, that's never happened before and it's not happening right now. We're getting someone massively fraudulent. It is the only chance. I've been saving these coins for two or three months. You guys have been following my journey as a free to play. A content creator, I don't know how to call myself. I'm just, it's just like a diary, just like a journal. I'm playing for myself, I'm recording the videos. You guys find it interesting, entertaining and funny. You guys subscribe, I appreciate the love. You guys actually support me by becoming a member, Legends Club member, I'll be, hopefully I'll be streaming more later. I just can't promise anything right now, but definitely this is the most, the biggest pack opening on my channel. Speaking of the cards that Konami is offering, there is Wesley Snyder, very nice. This is a slightly boosted card compared to his other uh, version. Uh, there is obviously epic card of Snyder from Inter released before. This is gonna be your Modric, but with improved dribbling pretty much. And uh, anything else, he's great, quite pacey as well for a midfielder. He can power fantastic as well, so many different skill moves in terms of like, uh, Shooting techniques, you see knuckle shot, there is a long range drive, which is like a, helping you to curl better. And there is a pinpoint crossing as well, like what a player, low loaded pass as well, very nice um, animation on this loaded balls too. So that's a fantastic pull, even though I wouldn't, I'm not really looking forward to get him. You know why? You, you, you know why? You know why I'm after Sheva here? There is this uh, Francesco Totti, a slightly, like you see, the auto allocating. By the way, speaking about the, of the training, I don't even mind auto allocating at all. So I like it how Konami is offering me. So for this Snyder, if you're playing him as an attacking midfielder, this pace numbers is just great. For Totti, it is pretty similar. Actually, Totti, I don't think that, I think Snyder is like a much better player than Totti. So every player in this pack, I'm talking about these epic cards, has a booster. So for instance, Sheva has a booster on his agility, plus to increase the speed, acceleration, balance, and stamina. So when you buy, when you get in, obviously not buying, you can't really buy him outright. I wish I could. When you get in Sheva, you are getting this agility boost plus two. So when you're training the player, then you don't have to worry about uh, agility or speed uh, that much. You don't have to train that. You need to actually, uh, Take care about this uh, plus two, uh, like consider this plus two as a booster and tr use this uh, progression points on uh, other skills of this player. So for instance, this uh, Totti gets plus two in shooting, so that's good. And this Snyder is getting plus two in uh, technique, plus two to ball control, dribbling, tight possession. So interestingly, Schneider, uh, Snyder has already a great dribbling stats, right? So what I would be doing is probably downgrading his dribbling like that. He's still getting plus two, you see? He's still getting fantastic stats. Dribbling 88, ball control, tight possession 96. He's gonna be Messi-esque. And then improving, maybe finishing if you want to take a shot with him, right? And then dribbling a little bit like that. I don't really want to fiddle with the, um, you see, maybe balance to 90, you can stretch it a little bit, you can see it right now, oh, like that. Yeah, you can maybe increase his balance a little bit, uh, but overall it's a it's a great card as is, uh, even with out allocated points, I, I like it uh, like that. I just like, I think it's a little bit overkill that position 97. With the additional manager boost, you're gonna be getting 99, so like it's just a little bit overkill, I think. You can use the stats elsewhere. And then Totti gets shooting improved, so maybe shooting can be 85 for instance, or 84. Uh, and you can then use the stats in improving his dribbling for instance, right? Yes, like that. So this is looking very nice. So these players are very similar. It's just like on paper, Snyder looks a little bit more overpowered than Totti. And finally, finalmente, Grande Sheva is here. I'm so excited. I know that I'm not getting him. I know that I need to spend 15,000 coins with my luck. I haven't pulled a single premium player from a pack like that before. It's just like, it, it, nothing I can do about that. Um, it, it, I hope that Konami is actually gonna be uh, the Konami gods are gonna be smiling down on me. 
Domo Rigato Kanami, please give me a player that I need. And for this training guide, if, Kana if Kanami is giving you booster plus two on shooting, what you do, you just downgrade his finishing to like 88. That means that with the team playstyle boost, uh, like with the boost of the manager that gives you that playstyle boost, or whatever it is called right now, it's not playstyle boost anymore, but whatever. It's gonna be plus two, and then booster gives you plus two more. So maybe shooting 86. You see, like, when you're gonna be getting this player, you understand what I'm talking about. Right now, I'm talking about wake numbers. These are not displayed on this website, this eFootball hub. Uh, but the boosters are gonna be giving you plus two. The manager is gonna be giving you plus two as well, most likely. You just have up until 28th of September to retrain your players as many times as you want. And then you have so many different points to redistribute, redistribute where you're gonna be probably training a little bit of his dribbling like that and improving his acceleration to boost his balance. You see, this is what I wanted to do. I just didn't want... Yeah, acceleration to 85. Yeah, okay, maybe maybe then lower body strength. Yeah, it's just like 1994 though, like you see? 30, yeah, we can do it like that. We can do it like that. And then aerial strength, 75 is good for heading. It's nice. It's a nice card, you see, 97 overall instead of 98, which is uh, when you're gonna be out of like 18 points. I don't see a problem is, is that like overall number is not that important. What is important is having these numbers uh, to the best of your understanding. How are you gonna be using this player? I want my player to be technical on the ball. Passing is okay because I'm trying. If I'm ever getting Shevchenko, I'm gonna give him one touch passing. I'm gonna give him heel trick so that he can pass the ball in awkward positions, short passes. I'm not trying to do anything unusual with him. Maybe through passes as well, just because if he gonna be combining with other players, I'm gonna be giving him a through pass and through pass he's slipping that ball into another striker or a winger. And then maybe I'm gonna be, of course, giving him double touch because, like, with this dribbling, I mean, it's not really justified. I would want to have it in my 85s. That, that's how I gave my Cristiano Ronaldo uh, double touch. And, I mean, it justified because his dribbling is great. Like, 85, 87 is the numbers that I trained him. But uh, this is great. Like, he's gonna be pace demon. He's gonna be fast. Physicality is decent. Balance is decent. Stamina is great. Weak foot usage, we don't care about that because he has outside curler. And he, if he has no outside curler, like this website is showing no outside curler. But who cares about the websites? We go to the game itself and let's see what kind of skills Kanami is giving us. There is outside curler, so if Football Hub is not displaying that, no worries. We know all the skills over here. Soul control is great just because it gives you additionally like a little bit more precise dribbling. And when you give him double touch and... Uh, Flip flop, you're gonna be getting a special double touch. First time shot, very nice. Long reach curler. Curlers have been overpowered. That's fantastic skill to have. Heading, I'll be giving him aerial superiority too. Acrobatic finishing is also great. So, I mean, that's a striker that I like. That's a striker that has a little bit of a dribbling. He's quite fast. Well, actually, very fast. He's sturdy, so he's not gonna be bullied easily of the ball because of good balance and decent physicality. And then his finishing is fantastic as well. And the fancy awareness obviously is great with any build that you're doing. With Ata build, it's 94. I mean, I don't know how you should be butchering the card to get less than 94 or actually 90. Um, Offensive awareness, which is great. It's gonna be making the runs. His playstyle is goal poacher, so what else do you want? And obviously, they get other uh, featured players from Italian League, which I don't really care about. The only players that I care is Andrei Shevchenko. I have 2000 and 800 coins. I'll be clearing uh, this pack only with 15,000 coins, which is I don't even have like a fifth of that. So the odds are against me like usual. I've never gotten a single epic card from this pack, but we try with one. Okay, like that. 400 coins. Let's see if Konami gods are favoring us. Getting nobody. We're skipping that. Nobody is interested in seeing the same animation. And uh, we're getting. We're getting massive fraud, but it is what it is. Two tries, one free, one for 100 coins, 200, uh, 2700 actually, coins, 900. This is the first time ever, first time ever I'm using 900 coins in one try. This is a scam, don't do this. You're watching me spending coins and getting absolutely nobody. Uh, it's a tragedy, it's a travesty. We're getting, oh, we're getting someone. Oh wait, um, it's not, it's, it's probably just a standard like this. It's not an uh, epic card. I guess it's not an epic card. I was actually excited because the the epic card animation is different. We are getting someone, but that's not Wesley Snyder. That's not Sheva. That's like some random, I mean, not even custom face player. Talent League attackers. We're getting Red Tegui. Yeah, that's a massively fraudulent pull. I just, I'm disappointed, Konami. 
I'm disappointed. Okay, so now we're going to be doing 9 tries for 100 coins and then we'll try and then we'll end it with uh, yeah, we end it with 900 coins. I know that with my with my luck is just like I mean, I, I it's just like either should I be counter jinxing it? I'm getting absolutely nobody. I am so sad. This pack is a scam. We're getting three star players. It's just like that's where uh, these packs are for pay to win players, like or people who are just not it's just pay to win is a little bit um, of a harsh, uh, harsh way to call people who are you playing money on this game. And I would be let's see, I'm getting faceless players. It does. It's just like people who uh, don't mind spending coins on this game, and you guys are asking me since the previous season to actually spend coins only the ones that I'm getting from events and from login campaigns and I was actually saving the coins for exactly this purpose I'm getting lots of fraudulent players and just so that you know I know that in the comments people are gonna be saying Alex I got your channel on my first try and I was like wow I, I believe you wow that's impressive I'm so happy for you and I'm so happy happy here <laughs> and just like and it's fair you can get someone on your first try but uh, you see I was doing this for two years I've gotten zero premium epic cards not to say that I was using like at least nine pulls per pack i usually was going in like one or two tries but it just goes to show how difficult it is uh, to pull these players and it just goes to show that these players are meant to be packed with uh, people who are buying coins because otherwise you might be lucky in one pack and that can be it but it's just like the problem is that konami is not even allowing me to have this luck even with one pack and i'm actually disappointed see i'm disappointed and this video will be ending apparently what I, I already feel that it's gonna be me asking you guys whether I should be going for uh, coins, buying coins and getting this Shava because this Shava, I really, really want him. But on the other hand, that will be the end of my free to play journey and I'll be called pay to win account from thereafter because the only player I want is Shava and we're getting close. You see, we're getting, we're cleaning the pack a little bit, but we're cleaning the bottom of the pack. I wish we could get Shava from our first try next time. It's just like, wow, that would be like a dream card. Imagine all this. I mean, I would be training so many different skills on him, trying him in different modes, making reviews. This is something that I was, I was actually dreaming of. Can I mean, adding Shava card and they're treating me like that. It's just like a shame. You get messy with the boosters for 1500 coins and I already spent more than that and got nada, absolutely nobody. Let's try 10 tries. 900 coins for 10 players. Can I get an epic card right now? Pretty please. I need special animation. No, I'm not getting anyone. And that's unfortunate. That just goes to show that I will be having to get uh, coins. I think I'm gonna get getting coins. I will be making probably a poll on my channel asking you guys whether you want me to spend coins on Sheva and uh, how many coins, how many coins should be wasting. This is a useless, useless pack. We are getting Hendrik Mikitarian, Mikitarian, uh, yeah, lots of discardable material and we're getting final try, 150 coins. Konami ruins me, like in not even a single epic player. I was uh, after Sheva, they're giving me another um, special player which is i mean i'm not even no, nothing to celebrate realistically so there you go if you guys want me to film part two of this pack opening drop a like like a thousand likes i think we'll do and we'll continue otherwise i don't know what to do i don't know if i should be going into this pack uh, if it's worth it how much money should i be spending on it is Sheva worth it it's gonna be a generational card definitely i'm gonna be using him in my team just like it's a shame that we already packed 30 players and not even close, not even close to Sheva. And uh, I have 50 coins left. I mean, if you guys want me to buy coins, drop a like, comment below. I'll be making a poll. And this has been the review and pack opening. I hope you enjoyed this uh, miserable video and I'll see you in the next one. Peace!